Oh dear, not again. Oh no! Hey, Stuart, are you okay? I think so, George. But there's a problem. Oh, no. The photo album for my school project, it's ruined. I'm so sorry, George. Sheesh! Look, bats fly, mice don't. When are you gonna learn? It's okay, Stuart. We'll just have to take them all again. No. No, you won't. It's my fault, and I'll fix it. I'll retake all your photos myself. Oh, but we'll help you, won't we, Snowbell? <laughs> yeah, yeah. For a price. Here we are in the garden, the place you're going to start replacing those photos. Some should be real easy, and others... <laughs> well, let's just say I'm real glad it's you doing this, and not me. Remember, though, you don't need all of the photos to finish the project. And once you've got enough of them, then I can take you on to new areas of the neighborhood. To take a photo, you're going to have to power up the flash on your camera. Power comes in two sizes small sparks, and big charges. Collect enough, and you get flashes for your camera. Now, to start you off on your little mission, I can help you with your first photo. Your first photo is of me. To take this shot, you need to run over to the photo medallion over there. Pick up any sparks or charges you find on the way to power your camera. Go do that while I compose myself. This is a bird, eating from one of those hanging food things in the garden. You know, I tried some of that stuff once. Too much like health food for me. To help you even more, this is your radar indicator. When you get a new hint, this will show you where to go. At the moment, this is pointing toward the bird feeder on the wall. Before you run off, remember, if you get stuck on a photo, then you can just open the book, choose a new one, and I'll give you a hint about it. Margolo will also be around to help, and I'll keep an eye on you in case you need me. This cat will self-destruct in five seconds. <laughs> just kidding. Now, go on. Get on with it. That's you and George. He's busy driving one of his car things around the garden. So to get his photo, you'll have to beat him in a race. Try not to get run over. This sprinkler in the flower bed creates a nice rainbow, but you'll need to turn on the tap first. Get your blimp and use it to fly up onto the wall. If you can't find the blimp, try the garage. Once on the wall, run over and turn on the tap. Then, just get back down and take the photo. Woohoo! Go find a golf hall and call for Mr. Stout. If you can beat his score, which even you might be able to do, then you can take a photo of one of his trophies. <laughs> nice work if you can get it. Well, there you go. Thanks, Snowbell. That's Mr. Little's prize-winning plant thing that he keeps in the greenhouse. If the door's shut, then you can shoot the lock open with your bow. That's one of your stunt photos. You'll need to go to this ramp on your quad bike and ride as fast as you can to make the stunt. If you do it right, then George will take the photo for you. Make sure that the window is open first. You can use your bow to shoot the latch. If it ain't open before you do the stunt, <laughs> then you'll just go splat.
Hi there, Margolo. Hi there, Stuart. This is my garden skateboard challenge where you need to perform a number of tricks within a time limit. A trick can take place in the floor trick zone, on a grind rail, or on a ramp. To help you, I'll tell you where you need to be and which buttons you have to press for each trick. If you win, then I'll help you out with one of your photographs. Are you ready to play? Fantastic, Stuart. Do you need some help with your photos? Thanks, Margolo. Yes, I need a photo of the two of us. Okay, Stuart. Just tell me when you're ready to take the picture. Just waiting for you, Stuart. Okay, just setting the timer. That's you and George. He's... Hey, George. How are things? Real good, Stuart. Just practicing on my radio control quad bike. Can I take a picture of you, George? Well, okay. But only if you beat my quad bike race. Do you want to give it a go? You bet. Speed is my middle name. That was fantastic driving, Stuart. Thanks, George. Can I take your photograph now? Sure you can, little bro. Well, we're in the garden and it's a perfect day for some golf. Now, Stewie. If you can beat my score on the course, then you can take a photo of one of my golfing trophies. Or, if you want, you could just practice on this hole. <laughs> Snowbell Airlines, the only way to travel. Right, Stuart. This is the forest. Uh, before you get going, though, I'd better tell you, whenever I take you to a new area, you gotta leave your camera flashes behind. Nah, don't worry. You'll get them back whenever you return to that area. I'm sorry about that. Uh, new York transportation safety regulations, you know? Eesh. Anyway, let's open the book and see which photo you should try for first. That's a picture of you and Jenny. Cute kid. I think she's driving her radio-controlled buggy thing somewhere in the forest. To get this photo, you'll have to win the race, beating Jenny and her friends. Drive careful now. <laughs> Woohoo! Hmm. That's a photo of Connor, the juggler. But he doesn't seem to be in the mood to juggle right now. Maybe if you can help him out, he'll start again and you can get the photo. Hi, Jenny. Can I take a photograph of you? Hey, come on, Stew Pot. You got a photo of me yesterday. Oh, I tell you what, though. If you can win our buggy race, then you can take another one. Are you ready to rumble? All right, then. Let's race! That was a great race there, Stuart. You are fantastic. So, can I take your photo now? Oh, yeah. Go ahead, Stew Pot. That's you with that weird RC kid. Yeah, I've seen him down by the water, racing his remote-controlled, you know, hover thingy. If you challenge him and his friends to a race and win it, then I'm sure he'll pose for your photo. Hurry up! All this water makes me want a tinky. How are you, RC? 
Never better, my friend. But now you must use all your training to beat your latest challenge, for I have constructed a new hovercraft race. Are you prepared? Okay, RC. Let's go for it! You have achieved mastery of the hovercraft. Well done. You have taken your first step into a larger world. Hey, can I take a photo to commemorate my success? Certainly, my young student. Just inform me when you are ready. It's a photo of Katie flying her kite. I hope you have a head for heights, since she's got her kite stuck in the nearby tree. You're gonna have to climb up there and get it for her. Hi there, Margolo. Hi there, Stuart. This is my Forest BMX Challenge, where you'll need to follow the course and perform a number of tricks within a time limit. A trick can take place in a floor trick zone, on a grind rail, or on a ramp. As you follow the route of the course, I'll tell you what you have to do and which buttons you need to press for each trick. If you win, then I'll help you out with one of your photographs. Are you ready to take the challenge? Oh, that was just incredible, Stuart. How are your photos going? I need to take a picture of the flag on the flagpole, but nobody's raised it today. Oh, I think I can handle that for you, Stuart. Oh, thanks, Margolo. That would be great. That was great, Margolo. See you later. See you, Stuart. This one's a picture of you and Frank the park ranger. But he's got a small weasel problem at the moment. If you can chase them down for him, I'm sure he'll be happy enough for you to take his picture. That's the lucky charm. Oh, thanks for getting me charm back. I can juggle properly now. Glad to help, Connor. Whoa! A picture of the sleeping park attendant. This'll be a difficult one. He always locks the door to his hut. But since I'm such a smart cat, if you get me some cat snacks, I'm sure I can find a way to get you in. Hello, Mr. Park Ranger. What are you doing? I'm keeping an eye out for those dratted weasels. They're tearing around the forest in their truck, terrifying the wildlife and the public. What do you call a squirrel? A target? <laughs> That's them, the tiny little vandals. They're too small and fast for me to catch. Can you help me, Stuart? Sure, I'll stop those weasels. Uh, who likes the forest anyway? See you later, mouse boy! Fantastic, Stuart! You stopped those vicious weasels. Now, peace can return to the forest. Great! Can I take a photo of you now? Certainly, Stuart. Not a problem.
That's Katie's kite. Oh, thank you, Stuart, for getting my kite back. Ah, uh, it was nothing. Hope that helps. That's great, Snowbell. Ah, the great outdoors, where one feels closer to nature and desperate for around the golf. Now then, Stewie, if you can beat my score on this course, then I'll get one of my trophies for you to photograph. Or, if you want, you can just practice this hole. You ready to play, Stewie? Let's play this course. Okay, Stewie, let's play the course. Well, that was an incredible round there, Stewie. You've beaten my score for the forest course. Now, here, this is the trophy I won at the Long Island Tournament. That's great, Mr. Stout! Yeah, the street, or as I like to call it, the great big litter tray. <laughs> right, let's get out the book and see which photo we should go for. Right, let's see which photo you should take next. Here's a picture of Mrs. Little leaning out of the window. To take this one, we're going to need to get her attention. See if you can shoot that doorbell with the pop gun on your tank. That should do the trick. Maybe she'll remember to feed me too. I think I'll hit that now. Hi, Mom! Can you stay at the window while I take your photograph? Sure, Stuart. I can do that for you. Here's a picture of Mr. Kirby sitting in his newsstand. This morning, he lost his keys down a manhole, so he can't get in. The workman repairing the street hit a water main last night. So now the drains are flooded as well. Use the pump to dry out the drains. Then you can head on down to look for those keys. Hello, Mr. Kirby. How come your newsstand isn't open today? I dropped my keys down the drain and they're just out of reach. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Hmm, I might be able to help if I can just figure out some way into the drains. Oh, Stuart, it would be so great if you can get them back for me. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Woohoo! I've got the keys! Ah, thanks, Stuart. With my store open, people can read the news again. And I can take your photograph. That's one of your stunt photos. You'll need to go to this ramp in your police car. Drive as fast as you can to make the stunt. If you do it right, George will take the photo for you. Hi there, Officer Mahoney. Having a busy day? Too busy, Stuart. A gang of weasels has been seen robbing stores in this neighborhood. Ech, 
extra, extra, read all about it. Weasels rob newspaper stand. Ha <laughs> ha, news at 11. <laughs> Those weasels have robbed the newspaper stand. They're too small and fast for me. Can you chase after them, Stuart? Sure, Officer Mahoney. I'll help stop those wicked weasels. Hey, this is a frame-up. We didn't do it. Uh, yeah, we did. Shut up, fool! Who you call a fool? Ma was right. I should have got Cousin Luke to help instead. Yeah, I am Luke. Oh, well done, Stuart. With your help, the weasel menace has ended. Then, would it be okay if I took your picture? Certainly, Stuart. You go ahead. This is a picture of you and Tom. I think that him and his friends are racing their remote-controlled cars around the street. So, to get this photo, you're gonna have to beat him and the other kids in their race. Argolo? Hi there, Margolo! Hi there, Stuart. This is my street skateboard challenge, where you'll need to perform a number of tricks within a time limit. A trick can take place in the floor trick zone, on a grind rail, or on a ramp. To help you, I'll tell you where you need to be and which buttons you have to press for each trick. If you win, then I'll help you out with one of your photographs. Are you ready to play? Sure, Margolo. I'll take the challenge. That was incredible, Stuart. Thanks, Margolo. Is there anything I can help you with? Yeah. Could you get the dormant's hat back from the tree? Sure, Stuart. Thanks, Margolo. That was great, Margolo. See you later. See you, Stuart. Yeah, <laughs> that's a picture of my buddy Monty locked in the back of the fish truck. Jeez, if you can find me enough cat snacks from around the street, my tummy tells me that I'll be able to find us a way in. It'll just be a simple matter of finding the right position to take the photo. Hey, this is another picture of you and that RC guy. You know, the one who thinks he's some kind of Zen master? Right, now to get this picture, you're gonna have to beat him in a race with your roadster. At. Well, there you go. Thanks, Snowbell. This is a... Hi, Tom. Are you busy or can I take a photo of you? Well, I'm a bit busy playing in this taxi race, Stuart. It's really tough because we're not allowed to drive on the road. Tell you what, if you can win the race, then I'll let you take my photo. <laughs> Do you want to join us? Sure, Tom. Let's race. Whew! 
<laughs> now I know how it feels to be a cabbie in New York. <laughs> that was great, Stuart. You're a true champion. So, can I take your photo now, Tom? Oh, yeah, sure, Stuart. Just give me a shout when you're ready. Hey, Tom! Over here! Uh, hi, Stu- Uh, don't you want to be in on this one? Oh, yeah. Thanks, Tom. Well, you got another photo. Obviously, I'm a natural director. Which one shall I send you off to do next? Sheesh! Another photo of Mr. Stout and a golfing trophy. Hello there, RC. Hi, young Stuart. I have devised a new challenge for you to test your abilities to the limit. You must be calm, focus, and drive your roadster like you were on fire. However, to learn control, you may only drive across the road at a crossing. Are you prepared, my student? Okay, RC. Let's go roadster racing! With the street being closed for repairs, this was the perfect place to set up a new golf course. Now then, Stewie, if you can beat my golf score on this course, then I'll get another of my trophies for your photos. But if you want, you can just practice this hole. You want to play some golf, Stewie? Let's play this course. Okay, Stewie, let's play the course. I only got a four on this hole. Nice round there, Stewie. Now, here's the trophy I won at the Richmond Invitational game. Pretty neat, huh? It certainly is. Just hold that pose, Mr. Stout. This is the lake area of the park. Not my favorite place in the world. There's too much water around for me. Anyway, let's see which photo we should go for first. Eeny, meeny, miny, moo. Which photo shall we do? This is a picture of you and that not very nice Julian kid. He's racing everyone with his speedboat being obnoxious as usual. You'll have to beat him in his race and show him that he ain't as big as he thinks he is before he'll pose for this photo. This is a picture of Mrs. Potts from the flower stall. Her flowers are all closed up. Looks like they need watering. So if you can help her with them, I'm sure you'll get your photo. Hello, Julian. Can I take your photo? Oh, the famous Stuart Little needs something from me, does he? Well, actually, no, you can't, unless, of course, you can beat me in a speedboat race. Everyone says you're the best around here, but I've seen you race, and I don't think so. So, are we gonna race or what? Okay, Julian. I guess I'll have to race you then. No way! No one's that good! I can't believe you beat me! So, can I take your photo now, then? I suppose, but don't think I'm gonna smile or anything. Hello there, little Stuart. Hello there, Mrs. Potts! Wonderful day! It is a beautiful day, but the heat has wilted all my flowers. 
Could you help me out by watering them for me? Sure! I'll just go get George to help. Okay, George. If you drive the fire truck, I'll operate the hose. Will do, Stuart. Good luck! Thank you, Stuart. You have saved my flowers. Nice one, little bro. I'll see you later. Can I take your photograph now, Mrs. Potts? Oh, certainly you can, Stuart. This is another one of Mr. Stout with a golf trophy. I guess you're going to have to beat his golf score in order to take the photo. That's a photograph of the speedboat in the shed. Margalo is the only one who can help us with this, so you'll have to find her and win her BMX challenge. Once you've done that, I'm sure she'll help you with the speedboat. Margalo? Hi there, Margalo! Hi there, Stuart. This is my latest challenge, a new BMX course. You'll need to follow the track and perform a number of tricks within a time limit. A trick can take place in a floor trick zone, on a grind rail, or on a ramp. As you follow the route of the course, I'll tell you what you have to do and which buttons you need to press for each trick. If you win, then I'll help you out with one of your photographs. Are you ready to take the challenge? Stuart, you never cease to amaze me. Is there anything you need? Well, there is this speedboat I need to take a picture of. Oh, yes, I know where that is. I'll fix it so you can take your picture. Thanks a lot, Margolo. Hi, Will. What are you doing? Oh, hi, Stuart. We've been racing our radio-controlled quad bikes. Uh, Will, can I take your photograph? Well, sure you can, Stuart. Only, to make it interesting, I'll only let you if you can beat my quad bike race. Are you ready to give it a try? Sure, Will. Let the best man win. That was incredible driving, Stuart. So, can I take your photograph now, Will? Sure you can, Stuart. Here's another one of you and that RC guy. Either he really understands the mysteries of the universe, or else he's completely nuts. Anyway, You'll have to win his latest race in order to get this photo. Hey there, RC! Greetings, my young apprentice. Your appearance is precipitous for a new challenge awaits. Are you ready to take my latest test? Okay, RC! Let's race! I sense that there is little more that I can teach you. Soon, I will no longer call you student. I am both gladdened and yet a little saddened. Shall we remember this moment with a photograph? Yeah! You bet, R.C. That's a photo of the lighthouse. At the moment, though, the light's off. I can help you get to the switch that turns it on, but I'm so weak from hunger that you'll need to feed me some cat snacks first. 
Once you've done that, you'll just need to turn on the switch, then go take the photograph. Well, there you go! Thanks, Snowbell! I think I'll hit that... Woohoo! Here we are by the lake, and it's one heck of a water hazard. Okay, Stewie, if you want, you can just practice this hole. But if you can beat my score on the whole course, then I'll dig out another trophy for you to take a picture of. You ready to play some golf? Let's play this course. Okay, Stewie, let's play this here course. Nice work, Stewie! That was a fantastic round! Now, this is the trophy I won at the Manhattan Open. Keep playing like that, and you'll end up with one of these too, kid! Ah, uh, thanks, Mr. Stout! Hey, Snowbell! Let's go! Ah, home sweet home. Try not to make too much of a mess around here, okay? Right, let's see if I can figure out which photo you should go for first. Which one shall I send you off to do next? Here's a photo of Mr. Little. He's busy looking after Martha, so you're gonna have to watch over her and make sure she doesn't make too much of a mess. Then Mr. Little should have some time to pose for your photo. Hi, Dad. How's it going? Not too good, Stuart. Not too good. There's some things I need to do, but every time I turn around, little Martha makes a mess. Can you just keep an eye on her and clean up any mess she makes? Sure! I'll just go get George to help. Okay, George. If you drive the fire truck, I'll operate the hose. Will do, Stuart. Good luck. Well done, boys. Looks like you've managed to keep Martha under control. Glad we could help, Dad. See you later, Stuart. See you later, George. Oh, uh, Dad, can I take a photo of you now? Sure, Stuart. Just say when. This is a photo of the creepy old mask in the laundry room. Only problem is, you're gonna have to get really high up to take the proper shot. Okay, that's the fish in the tank on the landing. Turn on the light, 
then you'll be able to take the photo. Also, it means I can watch him swimming around and help myself build up an appetite. A photo of the rubber ducks floating in the bath. You'll have to fill up the bath to take the photo again. Uh, maybe you want to try the taps. <laughs> I hate baths. <laughs> This is a photo of you and Mrs. Little on the patio. I can probably help you open the door, except I'm too weak with hunger to move. <coughs> if you take my drift, maybe a few snacks might help. <coughs> anyway, once you get inside, find Mrs. Little and take the photo. Well, there you go. Thanks, Snowbell. Smile, Mom. Hey, aren't you in this one, too? Yeah! Just coming, Mom! Woohoo! Wow! I'm impressed! You've gone up in my estimation! <laughs> Just a bit. Which one shall I send you off to do next? This is one of your stunt photos. Go to this ramp on your BMX and ride as fast as you can to make the stunt. If you do it right, George will take the photo for you. Hi there, Margolo. Hi there, Stuart. This is my house skateboard challenge, where you'll need to perform a number of tricks within a time limit. A trick can take place in the floor trick zone, on a grind rail or on a ramp. To help you, I'll tell you where you need to be and which buttons you have to press for each trick. If you win, then I'll help you out with one of your photographs. Are you ready to play? Well done, Stuart. That was incredible. Is there anything I can do for you? Yes. Could you open your jewelry box so I can take a photograph? Certainly, Stuart. Mr. Stout! Now, Stewie, what we have here is an indoor golf course. The wonders of technology. 
Now, if you can beat my score on this course, then I'll get out another of those trophies for you to photograph. But if you want, you can just practice this hole instead. Are you ready to knock some balls around, Stewie? Let's play this course. Okay, Stewie. Let's play the course. I did this hole in three, Stewie. Congratulations! That was a fantastic round there, Stewie! Now, this is my most impressive trophy, the Hamptons Cup. See what I mean about it being impressive? I sure do, Mr. Stout, and I think I'd better record it with a photograph. Hey! Smile! I will, once you're over here. Okay, coming! Woohoo! Another photo! I can barely contain myself. That's the last one. Well, that's it. You've taken all the photos, finished all the stunts, fed me all the cat snacks, won every race, and helped out everyone who needed helping. And I couldn't have done any of it without you, Snowbell. Ah, shucks. <laughs> You're choking me up. <laughs> Come on, let's get out of here. <laughs> oh, wow, Stuart. This is fantastic. I can't believe you managed to get enough photos to finish off my project. I thought I was going to fail for sure. Thanks, Stuart. You're the best little brother in the whole world. That's okay, George. Anything for my big bro. Okay, Pilgrim. My job here is done. I'm going to stuff myself full of tuna and sleep for a week. See you later, Stuart. <sighs> much, much later. And second prize goes to Jennifer Serrano. Oh, hey, George. You might still get a prize. No, no chance. And first prize goes to George Little. Whoopee! Go, George! Come on, Stuart. Hold on. Coming through.